On May 6, King Charles officially becomes King of England, Scotland, Wales, Northern Ireland and some overseas territories. As Charles III, he takes over the regency after his mother Queen Elizabeth II. Who will take his turn after King Charles has already been clearly established. First come the direct descendants of the monarch. This means Prince William is currently first in line to the throne. Since the regency is always passed down in a direct line, Prince William's eldest son, Prince George, lands in second place. He is followed by his siblings Charlotte in third, and Louis in fourth place. Because Prince William has no other descendants besides his three children, the line of succession continues with the next descendant of King Charles, Prince Harry. He finds himself fifth in line. Sixth and seventh place go to his children Archie and Lilibet. That would exhaust King Charles's direct descendants, but the line of succession goes on. Next in line are his closest relatives. His sister, Princess Anne, should come next. After all, she is the second child of Queen Elizabeth II and closest to him in the family line. However, the rule of the firstborn at birth did not yet apply, instead male offspring were preferred. That is why Anne is only next in line to the throne after all her brothers. Prince Andrew is in 8th place instead of Princess Anne, and his daughter Beatrice and her daughter Sienna are in 9th and 10th place. In 11th place is Princess Eugenie, and her son August follows one rank after her. Eugenie is currently pregnant with her second child, this one will then end up in 13th place. The youngest son of the late queen, Prince Edward, comes next in line for the throne. He is followed by his children James and Louise. Finally, in 16th place is Princess Anne, whose children and grandchildren complete the top 20. Of course, there are also far more places in the succession. However, these hardly receive any attention. After all, it is unlikely that most of the royals will end up on the throne one day. So, except for Charles's direct descendants, the place in the line of succession has little meaning among the Blue Bloods.